Kia ora koutou, Lewis here with a brief look at the nation's weather over this weekend. So taking a look through the rest of Friday, we can see there is quite a large low pressure system sitting up in the north, but we do have high pressure moving in, taking charge across most of the island as we move through to the weekend. So that rain up north is basically just going to sit there all weekend and we can see high pressure moving in. And this is really setting the scene of what we're going to see through Saturday and through Sunday as well. Taking a look at the cool, cool temperatures that we're going to see tomorrow morning, definitely going to be a frosty one along these eastern and southern parts of the South Island. I'm not sure if I'd rather be someone spectating Saturday morning sport or someone actually playing it, because it is going to be very cold. You are going to need to rug up, but those cooler than average temperatures do move up into the North Island as well. I did say that there was going to be plenty of heavy rain around those Northland areas and there is a heavy rain watch in force currently until 11pm on Sunday. It does look like the most persistent and heaviest rain sets in Saturday afternoon until Sunday afternoon, so there is a good chance that that might be upgraded to an orange warning. So if you are up around that part of the country, do keep an eye on that and see if there is a warning or just further watches issued through the weekend. Now, taking a look at Saturday, high pressure moving in, taking charge of the weather around most of the country. There will still be the southerly flow bringing cloud and maybe some showers into eastern areas of the North Island, but it is the most persistent wind and rain going to be up around that Northland area. You can see plenty of clear skies towards the end of the day. That does mean it's going to be another frosty start as we move through into a Sunday. So taking a look just at the North Island here, I did say there's cloud and some showers moving into those eastern areas. Plenty of sunny sky through basically the majority of the North Island. It is just that northern area seeing those easterly wind flows bringing in that rain and like I said that potential for some heavier rain in the latter parts of Saturday. Auckland will mainly just be seeing cloud. There is just a small risk of a shower. It does look like uh, Coromandel Peninsula will kind of prevent those showers from drifting too far into the Auckland CBD. It might just be those northern areas clipping a few of those. And like I said, it is going to be quite cold as we move through the evening. So daytime temperatures are about average for August, but it is going to be a frosty morning, especially about these elevated areas. But even out east around Napier and Hastings could see a frosty start uh, to their Sunday. It is going to be warmer, but wetter around those northern areas and a low of just 11 degrees thanks to that wind and that cloud cover. Moving down into the North Island, plenty of clear skies in the morning time, a frosty start for most. It does just look like there'll be some cloud clipping around the southern part of the coast, maybe some parts of Banks Peninsula, but it does look like most people will be in for a fine and frosty Saturday. Seeing a nice bit of sunshine in the afternoon there. And as we get back into the evening, those clear skies look to remain, meaning another frosty start as we move into Sunday. So we can take a look at those minimum temperatures. Uh, minus five forecast for Christchurch on Sunday morning. Uh, we're seeing some more minus fives inland uh, around central, central Targo and Queenstown Lakes around those minus three marks. So really it's going to be frosty across the board for the South Island. And now taking a look at Sunday, it is a very similar picture to Saturday. High still in charge across most of the country, that low still spinning around up north, bringing that persistent and possibly heavy rain uh, to parts of Northland. And we can see the next sort of weather feature moving in from the southwest. Doesn't look like it really makes its way too far onto the South Island by the end of the day, but uh, people will notice a bit more cloud coming in front of that. And there is a wee little northwesterly wind, but it's not going to do too much to bring those temperatures up, things are going to remain cool. We'll just take a very quick look at Monday, that high still sitting out east, and we see that weather feature moving on, but actually weakening quite a lot as it does so, thanks to that high pressure still uh, maintaining a bit of stability around the country. So you can see by the time we get to the end of Monday, there isn't really too much in the way of persistent rain as it moves onto the North Island. So this is really the start of the new working week. That's all from me. For more information and staying up to date at metservice.com.